11.8, lesson 11.8, geom geometric probability. Uh, so this is where we get basically practice of two fields, probability. So understanding uh, you're looking for the win over all possibilities and probability, for lack of a simple way to put it. And it just practices your geometry. It's a, it's a good time to introduce the topic so you get more practice on your area. Pardon me, not geometry. So let's give a beginner archer. Uh, we'll give the name uh, Dr. Jones. And he misses the target a lot. But when he does hit it, could be anywhere. Here's his target. And his target has radius 1 for the inner circle, radius 2. The outer circle and uh, middle circle and radius three for the outer circle. So, what's the probability the arrow hits a bullseye if it hits the target? So, like I said, it's a win over all possibilities. So the win would be to hit the bullseye in that area in the middle there. So that is pi times r squared, 1 squared equals pi. And the whole thing would be pi times 3 squared, which would be 9 pi. So probability of a bullseye equals pi over 9 pi is 1 over 9. And that's how we do probability. Success over total. So here are the two principles. One's just linear. And one is area. And this is the bullseye we just did. Okay, and this one is on a number line. A, C, and we put a B here. And I randomly just pick a point anywhere in this number line. Let's just pluck some numbers, seven and six. What's the probability I hit? I have this backwards. What's the probability that I hit AC? There's a 7, and the total is 13, so that's my probability. 7 out of 13. Not too complicated, just again, practice on the probability and practice on the area. So here's the problem. I'd pause the recording, and then I'll do it for you. Read it first, of course. And now I'll go through it. Every 10 minutes, a bus pulls up to a hotel and waits for two minutes. Everybody always messes this one up. So here is zero minutes. Here's 10 minutes. And the bus shows up, stays for two minutes. A lot of people think the bus comes, stays for two minutes, and then comes back 10 minutes later. Well, read the question. Every 10 minutes, a bus pulls up. So that's every 10 minutes. So the next one's going to be at 20 minutes, 30 minutes, so on and so on. So person walks out the front door randomly. What's the probability of bus is there? A success. Two-minute window. Ten-minute total. One out of five. And that's it. RTFQ, read the full question. It'll help you out, especially for problems like this. Otherwise, get working. Good luck.